Welcome to this Easy Ads tutorial. In this video, we'll show you how to create a Meta Business Manager step-by-step -step, to promote your products easily on Facebook and Instagram. Here's what we'll cover in this video. First, you'll learn how to create your Meta Business Manager. Next, create an ad account and add a valid payment method to it. Then, add or create a Facebook page. Finally, connect an Instagram business profile with your Facebook page to enable your ads to run on both Facebook and Instagram at the same time. But first, what is a business manager? A business manager is an account type under which you manage all of your meta advertising assets, such as ad accounts, pixels, data sets, Facebook pages, etc. If you don't have a business manager yet, it's super easy to create. Start by opening a new browser window and go to facebook.com. Then, log in to your Facebook profile. Once you're logged in to your Facebook profile, open a new tab, then go to business.facebook.com slash overview. Click on create an account here. Add a business or store name, your full name, and an email address. Keep in mind that all of the details that you see on screen are for example purposes only. You will need to use your own information. Once you fill this form, click on submit. An email from Meta will be sent to the email address you provided, asking you to confirm the creation of this business manager. Once you confirm your email address, return to the same page and instead of overview, type settings. It will lead you to the interface of your business manager settings. This is the control center of all of your meta advertising assets. Now, to run ads, you need an ad account with a valid payment method. If you're wondering what is an ad account, think of it like a digital piggy bank. It holds the budget that your ads will spend. The ads manager, on the other hand, is like the control center for your ad account. It's where you create, manage, and monitor your ads, deciding who sees them and how they look. In simple terms, your ad account holds your ad budget, while the ads manager helps you use it effectively to reach your audience. When you create an ad account, you automatically create an ads manager. So let's create your first ad account. Always on your business manager settings, go to the sidebar right under accounts, click on ad accounts, then click on ad. You will be provided with three options. We will not be using the first two options as they concern the addition of an existing ad account to this business manager. So we'll go with the third one, which is creating a new ad account. Name your ad account, choose a time zone and the currency. Make sure that you choose the same time zone as your online store so that there is no offset between your Facebook metrics and your store metrics. Then. Click on Next. You'll have to select My Business and then click on Create. It's important to note that permissions inside the Business Manager are not granted automatically. So each time you create an asset like an ad account or page, you have to add yourself to that asset to be able to use it. So make sure you select your Facebook profile and enable the full control toggle, then click on Assign. Now, the next step is to add a payment method. To do that, click on Add Payment Info, select a country, a currency, and a time zone. Make sure that the details you select here are the ones that you want to use because, again, you cannot change these details later. Once you're happy with your selection, click on Next. Depending on your location, different payment methods will show to you. So just select the one that you'd like to use and follow the prompts on screen to add a payment method. I will do this off screen and then return. All right, perfect. So now that I added a payment method to my ad account, the next step is to add a Facebook page to this business manager. Always on your business manager settings, right under accounts, click on pages. Then click on the add button. You will have three options here to add a page, request access to a page or to create a new page. The first two options are for adding existing pages. The third option is for creating a new page. Since I already have a Facebook page, I'll go with the first option. To do this, you'll have to either enter your page name or URL. This is super easy to do. Let me show you. Return to the tab where you have your Facebook profile open and then switch to your page. Click here to enter the profile of your page, then copy the URL of your Facebook page. Return to the tab where you have your business manager settings open 
and paste the URL. Once you paste the URL, the page name will show and you can select it. Once you select it, click on Add Page. And you're done, you can click on Close. Make sure that you are added under the People section and that you have all permissions to this page. The other two options are also super easy to do. If you have a Facebook page that belongs in a different business manager, you can select the second option here and follow the prompts on screen to add that page. If you want to create a new page from scratch, that is also super easy to do. Just click on create a new page and follow the prompts on screen. Now onto the fourth and final step, which is connecting your Instagram business profile with your Facebook page. To do this, you will need to use your mobile. So I will switch to mobile now. Open the Instagram app on your mobile or tablet. Then go to your profile and tap the three lines in the top right hand corner. Then settings and privacy. For some accounts, the switch to professional account option will be listed directly under settings and privacy. Tap account type and tools, then switch to the professional account and continue. Select a category for your business and click done, then OK to confirm. Click on business, then next. Add contact details and click next. To skip this step, Opt for don't use my contact info. Now that you have an Instagram business account, you can proceed to make sure it's connected to your Facebook page. Always on the Instagram mobile app, go to your Instagram profile, select edit profile. Under public business information, select page. Now, I'm using a different Facebook page, but for you, you should be able to see the exact same Facebook page that you connected on your business profile here. Once you've selected your page, click on done. Congrats, you just finished setting up your Meta Business Manager. To recap, here's what you learned in this video. You first learned how to create a Meta Business Manager from scratch. Then you learned the difference between an ad account and the ads manager. You then learned how to create an ad account and add a valid payment method to it. We also covered how to add a Facebook page to your existing business manager in order to use it for advertising. Finally, we covered how to connect your Instagram business profile with your Facebook page to increase your reach and advertise on both Facebook and Instagram at the same time with minimal effort. In the next video, we'll cover how to create a dataset. A dataset is the same as a pixel, and creating one is super important to be able to run ads on Meta successfully. So click on the next video to continue the creation of your business manager. See you soon!